So Moribo Kita is like Kwame Kuma in Ghana. He is the founding uh, father of Mali, the first president. He fought for the independence of Mali in 1960. <laughs> Bonsoir. Uh -huh. Ça va, ça va? Baby, uh -huh. Ça va, c'est bien? Mm -hmm. Ok. Uh, merci. C'est bien. <laughs> We thank God that ça va, ça va, c'est bien. <laughs> Alright, so, uh, my beautiful angels, I'm just on my way to go see a friend at the airport. So, come along with me. See? The means of transport I'm using today. This is their bowling form of taxi transportation available in Bamako or the whole of Mali. They don't encourage Uber or Bolt or any of those online transportation systems. So this is what you get as a taxi here in Bamako, Mali. Yeah, I hope you can see it. Yeah. All right, guys, so you know, you know these bike guys, they can really tell lies, right? They told me that this uh, particular means of transport is the most expensive. And I've been boarding the bike almost every time. But today taking this, uh, boarding this from here to the airport is just saying sandwich is 500 francs. But when I bought the bike, they, the fare is about 1,000 or 1,500 francs, right? Yeah, but that was a big lie. They just received me slightly. But anyway, the bike is faster in terms of traffic. That's why I prefer boarding it. But it's a bit dangerous. Anyway, yeah. Hey, guys, can you imagine? Me, yeah. When I took the taxi, you see, I was telling you that it was it was cheap. No, no, he said it was taking five thousand from that place to the airport. Oh my goodness, I didn't know. My world, man. When I got down, no, I got down as quickly as possible, man. No, I couldn't. Hey, hundred cities just like that. No. So it is true. It is. I'm even speechless. Exorbitant. <laughs> eh? Oh, no, 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 no. They need Uber or Bolt here. Jesus. Yeah, taxi means of transportation. It's too expensive. It's too expensive. I would like it. Hey, God. I'm clear. <laughs> Guys. Forgive me, forgive me. I'm not clear. One thing about this uh, bus is I don't know if it is tuk tuk. I don't know what they call it. Right? One thing about this is this one today is kiss you. The way I'm so small and they have to kiss me is for that year, you guys. I'm not even lying to you. But the thing is that the taxi is. He was charging me. Uh, he was charging me ten times. Even even more than ten times. So this, this particular means of transport is charging me. I swear. So I just had to pay. This small thing is thinking about I want to show you the road, but the way they are speaking, Jay, if I'm saying, I'll be showing their piece. Mm -hmm.
A few moments later, you want to go to the waterfall. Waterfall. Yeah. You want to go. Mm -hmm. Okay, no problem. Yeah. <laughs> Welcome to another vlog. Yeah. So if you're new here, I'm coming at you straight from Mali here in Bamako. So welcome to Mali, the land of one people, one faith, and one goal. And 
you know, Mali is the cradle of civilization. If you don't know today, you know. Okay, Ghana is the gateway to Africa and Mali is the cradle of civilization. So, welcome to Mali. So, today we are right at the Modibo Kita Airport. This is the entrance to the airport and look at how the environment is. How the landscaping here is top notch, right? You can see how the flowers are long and they are all looking leveled and beautiful. And this very place is kept quite clean. Yeah, and it's looking good. The children are just excited to be here with me. <laughs> yeah, so we have a monument here. Monument de la Hoste. 25th May 1997. Okay, maybe monument of hospitality or something. Hello. Yes, I'm fine. I'm fine. <laughs> Afternoon, how are you? Okay, yeah, I'm also fine. <laughs> yeah. This one, this one, what is it? Hospitality. Okay. Okay, so it's monument of hospitality. Okay, yeah. That means they are kind people, they are hospitable. And that is what I'm experiencing here. Because I came and they have all right, bye. They have given me chance to film. So yeah, this is how the environment looks. As you can see up there we have Aeroport International President Modibo Keta Senu. This place is called Senu. Senu. Okay, so this place is called Senu. Yeah, this is called Senu Bamako, where the airport is located. So you guys, come along with me. Let's go right to the airport. Yeah. So you can see the landscaping is looking good. It, it beautifies the place. And it's welcoming as well. Yeah. So before you enter, they've written uh bienvenue meaning welcome in french my french is so bad please forgive me okay <laughs> and up there you can see something like centerville good yeah good 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 thank you so much mm -hmm. so at the entrance we have the police there guarding the place this place is extremely secured okay before you even enter you have the military men far off before you come to the gate president of Mali who is called um, President Modibo Kita. So Modibo Kita is like Kwame Nkrumah in Ghana. He is the founding uh, father of Mali, the first president. He fought for the independence of Mali in 1960. He ruled for eight years and he died via a coup d'etat on the commando camp. Commando camp. Commando camp. What? Modibo Kita was the president of Mali, the first president. First president of Mali. And he's, he was a socialist. He introduced a social form of governance to Mali. Uh -huh. And he ruled for eight years. And there was a coup d'etat, and he got killed in Jikoroni, in the commando camp right here 
in Bamako. So yes, that is why this place has been named after him. He is one of the most loved presidents or personality in Mali. One of the loved presidents in Africa. Yeah, so this place has been named after him. Yeah, so here is the airport. That's how it looks like. This is the arrival unit. Yeah, as you can see, you can see Aeroport International President Modibo Keta. Mini uh, President Modibo Keta International Airport. If you want to translate it in English, that is exactly how it will be like. So you guys, I'm not allowed to film so much, so I'll be ending it here. I just want to show you how this place looks. It's like someone is arriving. Um, very important personality is arriving. So the group is here playing traditional, you know, drums and dancing, waiting for him. Yeah, so welcome to Mali, the President Modibo Kita Airport. And this is how it looks. I, I feel it looks beautiful. From the entrance coming here, you saw how the flower lawns are and how they welcomed you with the monuments there, the monument of hospitality, showing that Mali is a hospitable country and the people here are lovely. This person is a military person giving me the opportunity to come here and film. Yeah, if they were not hospitable, they wouldn't have allowed me to come here and do this. So as you can see, the place is busy. When I was here the last time, it was a Saturday. It wasn't that busy. But today being a weekday, which is a Thursday, you can see the whole place is busy. Like it's full of people waiting for their loved ones to arrive. And then they give them very big hugs and kisses and, you know, share their happiness and joy with their loved ones as they arrive yeah so yeah welcome to the modibo kita airport named after the first and the founder president of mali so if you like the video kindly give it a thumbs up and do not forget to subscribe that is where they pack their cars when they come another parking lot as well they have two parking lots one here and the other at the end that is the uh, departure and this is the arrival as you can see so i'll see you in my next video until then i say bye bye